We're going to bring y'all back to some days in the 50s when rock and roll and rockabilly was new. Thank 
Vegas at the Impersonators Convention uh, last year, and uh, you know, all the impersonators go down there uh, once a year, and uh, we went down, and I went with Roy, and Chris was down there, Johnny Memphis as Elvis, and all that sort of thing, and we had to share rooms, you know, the world economic crisis and all that sort of thing, so everyone had to share rooms, and and uh, I uh, lined up, and there's literally there were hundreds of impersonators there, but I got to share the room with Marilyn. Monroe. Oh, right. I share a room with Marilyn oh. Monroe. Roy got Marilyn. Yes. I got Marilyn. How about that? And uh, who did you get, uh, Johnny? Who did you get? I got Liberace. <laughs> <laughs> and his brother George. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't sleep that night either, let me tell you. <laughs> but I got a jacket out of you though, okay? It's now or never. Mr. Frank Hamilton back on stage. Johnny Cash, give him a big round of applause for being to join us. Alright, fix that mic up front for him, okay, please? In 1956, there was a group of guys from Sun Records that got together that uh, became a historical event, actually, because that was about the only time they ever really got together. Now, and they called ourselves the Million Dollar Quartet. Well, we may not be worth a million dollars, but we ought to be worth a thousand dollars, don't you think? About twelve fifty. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Testing, are we hot? Yes, we're hot. Let her rent play the gym. These guys are fantastic. Thank you. 